What's up guys? Wait one second right here. Welcome to the new Rockcom vlog. Before we start, huge, huge, huge thanks to our new partner Audible who sponsored and approved our new episode. We're gonna make sure it's gonna be a sick one. Okay, this one is slow. There is a lot of explosives inside Dominic. We need to be careful this time. Is it radioactive? Uh, no, <laughs> it's not radio. Did you watch Chernobyl movie? Of course. Sick, right? Uh, okay, today is a huge uh, day for me. I was waiting for that moment for a long time. I wanted to drift my 790 Duke. Okay, we did it already when we updated the VP uh, suspension. But today is a proper drift test. And we made a mini drift area. Dominic, that was a long time ago since we do, did a motor drift battle, right? When was the last time in Turkey? In Turkey, it's time that we do another drift battle. So we have a mini drift track here, simulates a motor drift battle uh, track. And yeah, we need some obstacles to drift around. We have a small update on the 790, so let's go check it out. So we updated already on the 790, the front and rear suspension, VP, full Akrapovic exhaust system. I put, let me come closer, come closer, come closer. Some you would be me. I put a DB killer inside since it's a bit too loud for my practice spot. We have some offices uh, close to my practice spot so I don't want to be kicked out after so many years. And actually the biggest update for the drift test today is the rear sprocket. I'm using today a 52 sprocket from KTM Power Parts. I used that sprocket on my 690 Duke for many years but now we went in bigger. But today I want to try how it feels on the 52 and maybe if I need to change it to a bigger one. A uh, bigger sprocket is important to make the drifts easier on the tight corners like today we have here. And with a stock one it's a bit harder, it's possible but it's much easier and much better. You have better control and everything with a bigger sprocket. So this will be the test today. So Dominic, yeah. long story short, let's go first try. Yeah, of course. So let's go see how the 790 drifts. Man, Dominic, how is the feeling? This bike is so sick, unbelievable! I love that 790. The more I ride it, the more I feel comfortable. Woo. It becomes more and more stuntable, more and more fun. It's super fun on the road when it's uh, road legal, but now on the stunt spot with each upgrade is super fun. What I can say for the first test that we have, the first drift uh, session here, uh, super smooth power delivery because it's a two inline cylinder engine and I'm riding always one cylinder engine so it's a huge difference for me. And that power man, that power is uh, unbelievable. I love it, it's like I'm just using a little bit of throttle, I don't need to use the whole power on that bike because it has so much torque and uh, yeah, much more power than my previous bikes the second thing what I really feel is like the tight turns it has a longer swing arm so which means that it's easier to drift the longer it is the easier it is to go sideways so it's actually a super fun drift bike yeah so Dominic we are not done I would say let's go spice up that drift track what do you say yeah it's summer so let's have fun let's add some more obstacles and let's see how this bike can attack them Moto 
drift mini addition is done i mean the track so we try to squeeze as much as possible obstacles here uh, so i'm gonna fly from the start to the other side of the track and there is the first is the eighth drift like a number eight and after that when i finish we have a very creative uh, uh, situation or there it's an uh, idea from Dominic it's actually balloon I need to explode balloons gas gas guys I need to explode some balloons yeah we need some special effects <laughs> okay but that's uh, actually a pretty easy idea for that uh, test which is good we don't have so much time to to come up with uh, some crazy ideas so we, uh, when I challenge the next guys we're gonna come with some exp real explosion anyway balloon station I need to drift and hit the balloon with my back wheel. After that, I drive to the barrel, drift around, come back to a very special place. There is my friend, Mr. Joe. Maybe, can you see him? Yeah, yeah. Uh, down there. That's my friend Joe. And I don't actually want to meet with my back tire, Mr. Joe here, because, or I'm, I'm gonna bend my rear wheel on that curb here, or I'm gonna just fly there, just fly far away and maybe die. So we don't want to meet Mr. Joe here and it can create a pretty shitty situation. After that uh, shitty curb drift, we arrive to the tornado station. We will create a lot of smoke since 790 has tons of power. Let's see how he can smoke the tires. After the tornado uh, burnout to this next very creative place uh, balloons we need to explode some balloons after that station i'm gonna go to the end there are some two points for the slalom and then it's the finish point that's our moto drift mini edition track so let's go try it out quick teleportation from the drift track to the garage before we start to smoke some tires with the duke let me introduce you to our sponsor that supports that Moto Drift vlog, Audible. And uh, guys, I started recently to meditate. Yes, meditate. It's actually an important part of being a professional athlete. And because we are doing all this stuff on a very high level, which means a lot of projects, a lot of ideas, a lot of crazy ideas, and a lot of meeting with different people. And all that piles up in my head and it's uh, sometimes hard to focus so meditation helps me to put that in the order and let's say digest it and it really helps me so i started this a few months ago and uh, one of my favorite audiobooks on audible is 21 days of meditation but we didn't forget about you rockers with audible we prepared a 30-day audible trial and your first audiobook plus two audible originals for free so visit audible.com slash rockbagaros or send a text message rockbagaros to 500-500. Beside meditation, I love motivational stuff. So I love to listen to successful stories of people that are successful in business or in sport. And in sport, one of my favorite names is Novak Djokovic and especially his story coming from nothing to one of the biggest names in tennis it's amazing so this kind of story is really uh, fueling my imagination my motivation to keep practicing to to make some cool projects to not give up I'm doing stunt riding for more than uh, 14 years now and it's a long long time and I want to continue for double that time so I like to motivate me with this kind of uh, successful stories and if what meditation or sports isn't for you luckily Audible has the the biggest audiobook selection on the planet and definitely you can find something for yourself yeah you can start listening to Audible free 30 day trial and your first audiobook and plus two audible originals are free visit audible.com slash rockbagaros or send a text message rockbagaros to 500500 that's it guys let's go back to the drift track let's burn some tire and let's throw my 790 sideways
Okay guys, let's chance. The rain is stronger and stronger, so everything is super slippery, you know. But I can't stop, it's so much fun with the 790. Okay guys, are you ready? Dominic is ready with his camera. In three, two, one, let's rip! <laughs> like a rocket launcher, man. Left one. Ah, so slippery. Woo! Right one. That's the hardest one for me. Oh, did it! Balloon time. I can do it now. I can do it. Ah. Man, that water. Again, not. This balloon doesn't want to explode. Okay. Where is Mr. Joe? There are you. Oba! That was close. Tornado time. Balloon time. Finally they exploded. Finish. Woo. Okay guys. We are finished with the test, but we don't leave until we explode that balloon. Right, Dominic? Let's hit that balloon. It's going on my nerves, man. Now I even hate even more those kind of special effects with balloons. Finally! This balloon had some special material, I would say. You ripped it away, it didn't blow here. It blow up there in the corner. Yeah, yeah it didn't explode <laughs> on, the, on the impact. No, no. Ah, okay. Guys, that's it. As you can see, it's raining, which can be a good sign. The last vlog that uh, it rained heavy and we needed to stop earlier was a viral movie. You remember the supermoto drifting on the... So it has over 10 million views already. So let's see if this drift video, Moto Drift Mini track test will be so successful. That's why guys, we need you to share that vlog. That would be amazing. And this means a lot to us, right Dominic? Of course. We invest so much energy in that and even <laughs> shooting filming. in the rain. Yeah, filming in rain and no sleep i was just sleeping for three hours man that's a long day for me uh okay guys short overview as said before 790 great feels great we need to change the sprocket in a bigger one so i have a bit more flexibility when i drift and i hope you like that vlog uh 790 will be upgraded soon with some cool parts and we shouldn't forget huge thanks to audible uh to the is, is angry because the bike is too loud. <laughs> Audi Bleh, huge thanks to you guys to help us to create this kind of a fun vlog. We need uh, more supporters like this and you are pure champs. So guys, if you want to use a 30 days free trial on Audi Bleh, use the audible.com slash or send a text message rockbagarus to 500-500 so you can get a 30 days free trial on audible guys that's it i hope you had fun drop some comments below what should we do next what do you like on that vlog maybe some cool ideas for the obstacles we have three builds of coming up one is the 790 one is the rc race bike and third one i cannot tell you so that's it see you next time until then rock, rock on, on.